right we are now finding the general solution for sine x plus 1 is equal to cos 2x right here we have sine x plus 1 is equal to this one is a double angle identity and here we have a sign which means here it's going to be 1 uh, minus 2 sine squared x it implies that there then we now take everything to the right hand side to the left hand side which now implies that 2 sine squared x plus sine x 1 minus 1 is equal to 0 then there is equal to 0 then it's now quadratic in nature which now implies that uh, we can now factorize here it will be now sine open sine x open bracket 2 sine x plus 1 is equal to 0 then which now implies that either sine x is equal to 0 or 2 sine x plus 1 is equal to 0 then we consider sine x plus 1 is 0 first which now implies that x is equal to we now put arc sine of 0 that is sine arc sine of 0 plus k 360 which now means that x is equal to 0 plus k uh, 360 for k element of integers remember it's the general solution for sine we also say 180 minus 0 which now means that x is equal to 180 minus 0 is 180 plus k 360 still our k is an element of integers now we consider this one which is now to say sine x is equal to minus 1 divided by 2 which is minus 1 over 2 now we have which now implies out there arc sine there it now means our referral angle will be there which will be arc sine of minus half which means is equal to minus 30 so that is our referral angle and it will be in the uh, sign is negative which is negative 30 which is in quadrant number 3 or quadrant number 4 which means here it means in quadrant number 3 it will be 180 plus 30 which means our x will now be equals to 180 plus 30 which is 210 plus k 360 or it's also in quadrant number number four which is quadrant number four it will be 360 minus 30 which gives us a uh, 330 therefore or, or x is equals to 330 plus k 360 still our k is an element of integers